Let's go, Giants fans. The Cowboys lost. I, I thought they were going to win this game by like 30, uh, but it ended up being pretty much the opposite way. Uh, so Jordan Love played really well this game. Started off really strong with an opening drive touchdown. Aaron Jones running it right up the middle. Good thing the uh, Dallas Cowboys have Mozzie Smith, right? They drafted him in the first round. He's playing great. Here we go. And here they go with some bad offense. Now, Dallas wasn't awful, awful this game. There are a lot of things that happened. But Jordan Love just, I just want to watch him. But uh, on their second drive, they do get stopped. So they do punt it to the Cowboys. And then it's a pick six, except for it wasn't. And it doesn't matter because Green Bay scores. And it's 14-0 uh, pretty much at the beginning of the second quarter. The Dallas tries to get some offense going. You have Jake Ferguson here going up for it, catching the ball. And that's pretty much the only guy he had consistent contact with the entire game. They are saying, like, nobody's open. And then he takes his bad sack at a field goal range. And Jordan Loves comes right back down the field. Pretty much hitting all of his young, old, pretty much all their are young, young receivers. And they're up 20 to nothing now. And I'm just realizing this after it says be love on the end zone. That's kind of kind of interesting. Anyway, so late in the second quarter, Dak drives down the field. Two minutes left. And, yeah, just kind of a thought. Oh. Pick six to the house. So now it's 27 0. This game is pretty much over. And I'm not going to lie, this is where I started paying attention to the game. It was right before halftime. I was freezing my ass off during a run. I was like, let me check the Cowboys game. I watched the second half, and I was astonished. Dallas gets this um, end of half touchdown here. But I mean, that that's it for them. Like Dan Quinn, he was going to hire by Seattle. Like, what's happening here? Uh, is he just tanking his job to stay with the Cowboys? I don't know. That's a dumb theory. Uh, but Cowboys here driving at the beginning of the third quarter. CeeDee Lamb is excited about their offense, starting to gain some stuff. That's not a good look, CeeDee. Uh, they get a field goal, and then it's Jordan Love once again. And everything is working. His receivers are like, calling for a fair catch. This was not even the most wide-open play of the game. Aaron Jones, again, Mozzie Smith, Michael Parsons, where were you? And I'm so sorry. Um, that, was, that was a bad joke. But uh, Dallas, again, drives down the field, but it's kind of a garbage situation. They end up going for two. There's a penalty. And so they have to kick a field. Well, they don't have to, but they decide to kick an extra point that doinks. And so, yeah, nothing's really going well. And then you're like, okay, maybe the Dallas can get a stop. But then I'm not sure if it was effort-wise, but, I mean, look at this. How do you get this wide open? I've never seen anything like this. So now it's 41-16, to 16, end of the third quarter. Dak Prescott trying to make something happen. He can't. The Packers get the ball back, and guess what happened? Yep, um, Aaron Jones. <laughs> Aaron Jones, Jerry Jones, whatever Jones. And, yeah, so at this point, the commentators even were, like, not even talking about what's happening in the game. And then the Packers go for it on fourth down at the goal line. They extend their lead. Dallas does get a couple late touchdowns to make it somewhat interesting. But if you looked at the odds prediction, at no point were they above a 99.9% .9 chance to lose. He had a nice catch by CD, another touchdown by Ferguson, like a Matt Stafford, Dak Prescott type of thing going on here. Nobody's even trying to tackle him on this two-point conversion. But then it's like, let's focus. But then Kraft drops the ball. Packers fans, admit, you were a little bit nervous here. Like, it was funny because Jordan Love actually lost his perfect passer rating for the game. They jinxed it. Like, he was the first quarterback to debut with a perfect passer rating. He ended up uh, not doing that. All because the guy dropped the pass. But anyway, one last thing. At the end, Dak was still doing his cadence. Ferguson banged up, as you said, screen maker. Dude, stop doing that. We get the point. And you're losing by a lot. Uh, but yeah, so the rest of the video, I want to talk about Jordan Love. It's kind of weird how similar he is to Brett Favre and Aaron Rodgers. Like, Green Bay, you did it again. Congratulations. What you do is you beat Dak Prescott. Or the Cowboys. 6-0 and against the Cowboys, the Packers are. And, and please, Cowboys, hire Bill Belichick. He hasn't won anything since Brady left. I think that'll be a monster hire.